Um, yes, so, I mean, I think the important thing about this particular course is that it grew out of, although I'm a fine artist, um, I don't know how fine I am, I'm a painter actually, um, although, you know, my interest in drawing comes from fine art, I was actually appointed to this post um, uh, in order to look at drawing across the whole range of subjects within the university. And so, um, well, you know, I, uh, I started learning about drawing in this university by visiting a fashion school and had extremely interesting conversations with people about how they taught drawing and what they thought drawing was. And I mean, the interesting point really was that they apologised for not doing enough drawing and they felt they should do more drawing and that they had somebody who came in and taught life drawing to the students. And um, when we actually started to talk more seriously about it, I mean, it's impossible to engage with fashion design without drawing. And it's got nothing to do with life drawing. It's to do with measuring the human body. It's to do with turning things like this into flat paper and then coming back and making it in cloth. So it's all the time you're working from two-dimensional information through to three-dimensional information. And in that respect, fashion design is no different from architecture. You're creating three-dimensional structures from two-dimensional beginnings. And once you start to explore, you know, well, go outside of this building, visit um, uh, a school of geography, and um, uh, start looking at how much drawing they do, especially through cartography, and you realise that these are some of the most accurate drawings in the world, where we start to map things and... And people were capable of doing these drawings really very, very early on, as we know from the construction of the pyramids and from early navigation. People were looking at the stars and drawing lines, looking at the sunset and drawing lines and sailing those lines in boats that didn't necessarily want to go in a straight line. And what do you realise is that, you know, it, it, drawing is something that has determined not only how we know where we are in the world, but how we move through it and how we imagine ourselves within it, and it is the way that we have both pictured and positioned ourselves. So that is where we started from with this drawing. If you were to just take one of those and pass them on. And this is where I started from, which is um, the inaugural lecture when I came here five years ago, and it was really an attempt at talking about that bigger picture of drawing. And this is what the entire course is about, and it's something that People coming from a fine art background probably, uh, they get worried in one way because they think, oh, well, I don't know about fashion design, I don't know about cartography, I don't know much about geometry, and actually, can I explain perspective? All of those things worry the people coming from fine art. And then the people coming, say, from a design subject are thinking, oh my God, I haven't done any life drawing for years, when was the last time I sat on a hillside and sketched something? Uh, so everybody, in a way, comes to this course with some baggage, and the, I think the idea is really to try and dump as much of that baggage as possible and think about drawing, think about this bigger picture of drawing, not the micro picture, but actually, you know, drawing a tennis court, drawing uh, the markings on a road to stop vehicles bashing into each other, um, drawing lines on maps to apparently stop people fighting. You know, uh, it, it is an amazingly rich and beautiful world, this world of drawing, that somewhere in it, art schools cottoned onto the idea of doing life drawing. And it, 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 in a way, it's such a small part of the whole issue. And um, that's really what this course is about. And it's possible for somebody uh, who only is interested in cartography, I think, to constructively engage with all of the units in this course. And as we pointed out to somebody else, although we never mention subject matter in the course, it is possible to do the entire course drawing a life model, if you wish. Um, so subject matter is something we think individuals bring to the course. What, what we have tried to establish is the intellectual framework through which we teach drawing.